Okay. Um, some people are taking things like spirulina, blue green algae, and chlorella. Spirulina and blue green algae are not algae. Please understand this. They are not algae. They are cyanobacteria. Cyanobacteria is where they also make the uh, cyanocobalamin that some people take. Um, I think that there is, there's, there's been some idea that there is some properties in the cyanocobalamin that it's not really good. But I know in the spirulina and the blue green algae that they actually have pseudo B12, not real. And it gets into your, your cell receptor and it blocks, it does that. But they also have something um, trying to remember it because there's so many um, phenylethylene. They have phenylethylene, which is a stimulant. And that stimulant can actually keep you from having a lot of tremors. And it can keep your, your brain working very well. I mean, one of the things that they keep telling us about cognitive decline is drink coffee. Well, the thing is, the coffee makes you feel good now. And the phenylethylene makes you feel good now. But it drives the nerve cells to a point is, is kind of like racing your engine in your car and you keep racing your engine in your car to a point where you're going to blow a gasket people um so it also they also have lipopolysaccharides lipopolysaccharides otherwise known as endotoxins can eat away at the myelin sheath and cause nerve damage. But because of the components together, um, we don't see the symptoms of that until it's too late. So I'm, I, as you can tell, I'm not really big on allergies. Now, I'm going to go back to chlorella. I say, okay, chlorella. Chlorella does have a better B12 situation there. Um, but it's, they found that chlorella does not come by itself. It always has some cyanobacteria attached to it. So, and that cyanobacteria is causing problems. Yes, there's a, a good B12 in chlorella, um, but you also have the stimulant effects of the phenylethylene. And... To tell you what phenylethylene is, I'm going to give you a demonstration. For ADHD, one of the drugs is Adderall. Adderall has two, the two main ingredients are synthetic phenylethylenes. So basically, blue-green algae are basically giving you what Adderall gives people on ADHD. And we know that we can do better. So well, that's, my, that's my two cents. <laughs> Whoa. Um, de I definitely did not know that. And I'm sure many people watching didn't either. Um, yeah, there's so much.